one of the first of its kind initiative and is giving India a different kind of uh, an esteem in the world arena in more than one way. A, that's one of the biggest collaborations at the international level that ISRO has engaged with, with one of the most premier agencies called the NASA, which in fact took off much before we did. And today we are in a position to be equal partners with them. We have uh, contributed the S band, they have contributed the L band. So, in a way, we are partnering this new game changing experiment. Secondly, this is not only going to be confined to the disasters, etc., as we mentioned repeatedly, be it the cyclones or the floods or the climate uh, concerns, it would also to a very great extent produce a striking change of scenario in our aviation practices, in our shipping practices because there will be enabling provisions to penetrate through thick fogs, through thick clouds, through multiple layers of ice that you find at Antarctica, etc., which is going to bring in a lot of much of ease in the life of a common citizen as well. And third, the inputs being obtained from here, as I said, even in the case of Shivaju, are going to be provided to the rest of the world, just truly living up to Prime Minister Modi's mantra of Vishwamandhu Bharat. So I think it's a privilege to be associated with the Department of Space.